The name Whirl is a well-known one at the beach. There is the restaurant, the game room, the clothing store, the inn. Now Chris Whirl has decided to enter the lifeguard and beach equipment rental business. With a group of investors, he founded Virginia Beach Patrol Incorporated and put together a bid so attractive that city officials recommended that city council choose his company over two others that have had the exclusive franchise on the oceanfront since World War II. Whirl credits his firm selection to 16 innovations, among them a surf school that all 60 lifeguards he hires will have to attend. So More rigorous training than is required now. And there are a lot of uh, unique problems in the ocean, such as outsucks, riptides, obstacles in the water, that we want to teach these people about before they ever go to work out there. Another innovation, according to partner Ned Kuhn, is telephones at every guard stand, an improvement, he says, over the present system of posting flags to signal emergencies. At the time a rescue occurs on the oceanfront, a guard can have immediate backup, and that is immediate backup, from a supervisor and also from the captain of the beach patrol who will be in a medically equipped jeep which will ro roam up and down the boardwalk. Kuhn, who will manage the lifeguard, says five of the seven currently most experienced guard supervisors have already committed to beach patrol. He's one of them. His reason for leaving the old company, company to join the new? That I think there's a lot of room for improvement, and the present operators are pretty much set in their way. Worrell and Kuhn believe the only thing that can keep their company from getting the contract to patrol this beach this summer is politics, because if the main consideration is safety, they're convinced their bid is best. At the Virginia Beach Oceanfront, Joel Ribbon, The Daily News.